Hi, Christophe Lemaire. Um, Good you, morning. In, in Rail Link's arc, you finished second on prize. Um, that was the year when thousands of Japanese went over to watch uh, Deep Impact run. Yes. Did it feel like an even more special occasion that year? Uh, it will be a special occasion, of course. Uh, Deep Impact, uh, it was already uh, 15 years ago, nearly 15 years ago. So um, I think this year, uh, the Japanese fans will be very, very excited to, to watch Almonda in, in the arc. The Japanese horses uh, haven't won the race yet, so uh, they are really looking forward to uh, cheering a, a victory in the arc. Everyone always talks about it being the dream for the Japanese to, to win the first arc. Is it also, as a Frenchman, your dream to, to win an arc? Yeah, definitely. Uh, as a Frenchman, as a French jockey, uh, I, I dream to win the arc. This is the race for her, for, for us, and uh, especially to me, winning uh, the arc with a Japanese horse uh, would be fabulous, uh, would be magic, and uh, uh, I really want to bring this victory to Japan. In your time, you've ridden uh, in Europe. You've ridden many great horses, including the likes of uh, Divine Proportions, McPhee, um, Pride as well. H how would Alma and I compare to those? And the very best you've ridden? Oh, she's uh, definitely high rank, high ranked. Uh, uh, she's that kind of horse who gives you a different feeling uh, on the stretch. Um, only her performances uh, at the end will say if she was better than all these horses but for the moment what she so far what she accomplished uh, is already uh, fantastic and um, if she keeps uh, running like this uh, all around this year and the next years uh, she will be she will be uh, something special and what do you regard as being her best attribute her best attribute, uh, she's got some f uh, fantastic, um, special abilities. Uh, she, re she recovers very well from her, from her track work. Uh, she doesn't make any effort when she's galloping and she's got a tremendous uh, acceleration with a big long stride, very powerful stride, which uh, makes her cover a lot of ground at on every stride and uh, which make her so good. And does that versatility mean you think she'll be as good over nine furlongs on Saturday as she's already shown she is over a mile and a half? Yes, I have no fear about the, the trip she's running this week. Uh, she's won over a mile uh, in Japan, over 2,000 meters and mile and a half. And uh, every time she has shown the same acceleration, uh, she has shown the same class so uh, I think 1,800 meters will be a good trip for her, especially for her first run this year. Maybe she will be a little bit fresh. Uh, she will be very concentrated uh, for the race, so she should be all right. And um, it was, uh, there were reports that she might run at York, possibly before even running um, in Longchamp. Uh, if she runs at York, there's a chance she'll clash with Enable um, before. I mean, what, what do you make of Enable? What do I? What, what do you think of Enable? You, you're oh. impressed with her? Yes, of course. Uh, to win uh, back to back the arc uh, is not an easy thing to do. Uh, she's trained by a fantastic trainer. She's ridden by a fantastic jockey. She is fantastic. So I think this is the clash that everybody wants to see uh, for the sport. It will would be, uh, be great to have these two great fillies uh, on the same race. Uh, I'm really looking forward to, to go there or to, or to see uh, Almonda in, in Europe. Uh, but first step is Dubai <laughs> and uh, we have to be concentrated on Dubai.